Mary, what are you playing? Is that Ninja... Fruit Loop Ninja? What is it called? It's called Fruit Ninja, Dad. Well, we're trying to do a show here. Come on. Let's, let's oh, yeah. Play. Sorry. Okay. Okay. Hi, guys. Dad from Dads Are Funny. And Mary. And we just want to say thanks again for all the views. This is Q&A round three. We're going to um, be... We um, kind of screwed up. Yeah, we kind of screwed <laughs> up. We did this about an hour ago, and we realized we had not recorded any audio, so... Oh well, yeah. show must go on. So we're redoing this, and we just want to let you guys know that um, we appreciate you guys watching the show. Today we're going to do something a little different in a couple of ways. One, we're going to try a different texture pack. It's called John Smith. You guys recommended it. We're going to try it. We're going to get Mary's impression, my impression. Dad's going to comment, and I mean, Dad's going to read the comments and answer them, and I'm going to play. Yeah, we thought maybe we'd switch it up, and we'd like to know if you guys would like us to do that, or if you like it the other way around better, if you want Mary to comment. Uh, really, I think one of us will need to build and one of us will need to comment because it's kind of hard to do both. And we, we could try a mix and match. Just let us know what you think. We uh, were building uh, for about half an hour. Mary, I uh, elected uh, Mary as builder, and so she added to the house. You'll see a few things here. And then, Mary, go outside because... We have a great little thing that I'd like to show a viewer that I thought maybe was a little disappointed last time around. Raganui really wanted me to put a dad cave sign here. And at first I thought, well, you know, there's a few other caves on the internet uh, besides mine. So I thought maybe that might be copying. But then I thought, what the heck, we'll make a dad cave. So I put Raganui's name on there in case uh, someone wants to give us flack. So Raganui made us do it. Anyway... Hope you enjoyed that, Raganui. And let me give him a tour of what I've done. Uh, give him a tour of what you've done, okay, Mary. so I've been making a whole bunch of glass because I'm going to make a glass house outside. And I've been making coal out of wooden, wooden planks because uh, there's no coal. Except for one, which we found, but then we um, kind of blew up by a creeper. Mary, <laughs> what do you think of the texture pack? I think it's confusing. Look, that's a sword. Does that look like a sword to you guys? Is that really a sword? It's a sword. It looks like a pick to me. Well, the thing is, I like especially the, the terrain, like the dirt and the stone. Yeah, it looks cool. But I don't like the sword because I still... Hit your inventory. Hitty. Oh. That's a, that's a sword. sword. That's a shovel. That's an axe. Okay. Which, that looks like an axe. Well, that looks more like That a, looks like more like a... This looks like a... A, a hoe, maybe? A hoe. Not a pickaxe. That looks like a pickaxe. Hmm. And then this one looks like a spoon. A stone spoon. Yeah. Well, I guess every texture pack has its pluses and minuses. I like this a lot, but I don't know. The glass is disappointing. I'm really big into good glass textures. Yeah, but look at this. Yeah, I know. I mean, that looks like a... Cage. Yeah. Okay, guys. Not the best. Let's do some questions and answers. I'm going to add it. Uh, well, we'll just start with uh, a few points. Uh, DH community from the last Q&A. Hey, we uh, bought a new microphone. Hope you like it. This mic's for you. <laughs> um, Crime Mafter, you complained about some audio not liking it. I think it was a little noisy or I think as you put it, the audio sucked. <laughs> so this mic's for you too. I want to make a little special shout out to a young viewer by the name of Colin. Now, I hope I'm pronouncing your name correctly who watches the show, loves the show, and we appreciate you watching us. And finally, uh, one other person I, I forgot to mention her comment a couple of episodes or last episode ago. Her name is Janine34. I assume that's a she, given the username. It's kind of hard to tell on YouTube who's who. So I will use the pronoun she. Uh, she was sad that uh, a couple of days ago, uh, we forgot to mention her comment. I'm sorry. I was looking. I was just kind of looking through them. I wasn't really like watching each one. Wa like looking at each one. I wanted to say as many as I could, but it was kind of hard. Yeah. So, but I look at every comment and we respond to yeah. most of them. Yeah. Now, guys, also, if you don't get a reply back to a message or a comment pretty quickly, then chances are we're not going to respond because. The common questions, the ones that get asked a whole bunch, they're already answered on our main page. What the heck? What's going on? 
I just jumped for no logical reason. You were like bed bugs or something. Um, <laughs> so Janine34, anyway, um, uh, back to your point. Uh, she had a funny little line. She says, Mary, oh, look, creeper behind you. Dad, where? Mary, behind you, creeper. Psst, boom. Dad, what happened? Mary, you blew up the house. And she writes, thumbs up on this comment if you thought that part was funny. We really liked that part, Janine, so we're glad you liked it, too. And what I want to do is just, while Mary's kind of chopping a few things down and building her glass house, I want to answer a few questions. And I want to start with Save Poison 122 who writes, OMG, you guys rock. I would love to play with you sometime. I'm from Australia, but I love your vids. Please reply. By the way, I love Australian ac accents, too. Yep, Australian <laughs> accents, too. All accents are awesome. Except ours. Except ours. <laughs> and so appreciate that comment. Uh, Flying Potato in the Sky <laughs> says, Gots an idea for SOS, make it out of torches. You know, you are not the first person to mention that. That would be a great idea. I think I like the sand, too, because it gives a nice definition in case someone were to fly over. No one's ever going to fly over. Well, if they ever fly over, the white <laughs> sand and the dark color will be a good combo, but we will add torches, I think. We have a couple on there. Uh, Froggy113, 0113, says, Oh, face, no top comment. Here's my chance. Um, bacon. That was nice. Uh... XXX Speed Monster XXX says, You go, girl. I'm weird. Now, on that happy thought, let's move on, lol. Yeah, I thought that was kind of funny myself. Maybe a little weird. And Melanie Diane MB, if you'll remember her from a previous episode, says, Stop walking on your plants. Now, remember, she gave the seeds to us. They will disappear. You can also get more seeds from hoeing grass, but they show up randomly. I did not know that bone meal on grass. <laughs> Don't laugh, Mary. I'm sorry would make seeds. So we've had all this frustration about running out of seeds for nothing. Now, I think they added that in 166, but I can't remember. That's not the best gardener there is. No, I'm not. <laughs> so thank you, Melanie, for the advice and for the seeds in the first place, for that matter. And we have a few more, a few more suggestions. Well, the Simply Snipers says, this is what I've been waiting for. We appreciate that comment. I'm assuming you're talking about the next episode, or this episode. Uh, a, a couple of funny ones. Sans169BT says, guys, your house is cool, but get rid of the dirt and add wood. We're doing that slowly. It takes a little time, but we are doing that. Now, Lu Lego Studio Maker makes a comment uh, and says that he made a house that is similar to the Mary and Dad house. And I want to let you guys know that Lego Studio Maker and the Dizak One made uh, houses uh, of ours, or, or sort of like fancier versions of our houses, and, and other cool stuff. And we posted their videos on our website. Now, we don't typically do that on YouTube because we're really space-constrained on YouTube, but on our website, dadsarefunny.com, we can do whatever we want. So we added those two videos on the main page. Eventually, we're going to have a fan page, but right now everything is on one page because we haven't done the CSS and the HTML and all the crap we need to do to make a proper uh, navigation-driven website. So I'll leave the rest of the technical details uh, aside and just let you guys know that right now everything is on the main page, including these two nice videos. And if you guys want to add another video, just... Send us a link to a YouTube video, and we will pop it on our website after we watch it. Wilkieish says, The unevenness of your house has been bugging me since day one. Thank you for almost fixing it. Ha ha. Well, ha ha back at you, Wilkieish. We've been working on that. Uh, initially, we were kind of um, nostalgic for the uneven look, but as time has gone on, we've been evening it slowly and surely and knocking off the rough we? edges. Yeah, we... Well, you're in there diddling around, whatever you do. I'm out there slaving away, making that house look square. You've been making that garden. Well, that's true. The garden with the... Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what? What am I? <laughs> Explosive Banana Pro says, So, will you be releasing these episodes every Thursday? Excellent deduction, Explosive Banana Pro. Uh, we do release them typically on Thursdays. Uh, this episode, number 11, released on a Tuesday, which was a, an error on our part. We'll just leave it at that. 
and we will typically be launching on a Wednesday or Thursday a new episode. And in addition to that, other videos here and there. Froggy, uh, the day after we put this episode out, says, make next episode tomorrow. Well, I wrote back and let him know he'll have to wait a week, and that's kind of how the plan is, guys. And that's gals. such a pretty feather. What? It's like... It's so beautiful. It's so beautiful. By the way, I like your guys' uh, names for your YouTube channels. Yeah, they're they are pretty, awesome. They're pretty funny. Yeah. Minecraft Creepers 123 says keep up the good work. Shadow Flame 2010 says awesome video, keep it up. MG11399 Gaming. That's a mouthful. Says, hey guys, you make awesome shows. Thank you very much. And someone asks, uh, 17101. No, 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 I'm sorry. 17. Let's see. One seven one zero seven four four three. Oh my gosh! Says, why did you go back to the default texture pack? And the plan is on the regular episodes to use the regular texture pack. We'll, we'll talk more about that later, but that's that for now. Brobot nine two two says, I can't find your house. Now, now listen, guys. If you go to our main page, everything you need is there to duplicate the dads are funny. Uh, Mary, uh, Dad and Mary SOS Seed. Now remember, the episodes occur on the Dad and Mary SOS Seed. Look it up on the main page to make sure you get the case and the spelling right. This world we're playing on here is the Dads are Funny Seed. Different seed, two different scenarios. So go to the main page if you want to find the mothership. Everything is there, and we've had dozens of people tell us it works, so we're pretty confident that the instructions work. Uh, hey guys, I got the world. See, someone found it. And uh, this is way too cool to care. Nice username. <laughs> way too cool to care. Uh, says he got the world and he found a second dungeon, a skeleton dungeon. We should go. We should get that, Mary. Okay. It it you need you need it you need to go digging straight from where the indent is on the giant wall holding up Bald Hill, and you should find it. If you don't, sorry. Also, someone a while, a while back sent us coordinates to like four dungeons, so we're going to try to go back to that and locate all those dungeons so we can get all the goodies. Now, here's a cute little message from KelSFO2. Hi, I'm Kelsey. I'm Kyle Stormberg's little sister. I'm probably your biggest fan. I even made the farm on top of my house, and I have ladders going up to the top with a trapdoor at the very top. I really want to be on your show so I can have fun, for one, because I play on my brother's account on Minecraft, so my name on there is I Just Griefed. I told him not to name it that, so I can't play with anybody because of my name. I just play alone and do nothing, so I'm really bored. I'm only nine, so I spell badly. Well, KelsF02, uh, your spelling isn't too bad for a youngster. And not as bad as me whenever I was young. Yeah. You would laugh at how bad I am in spelling. Anyway... Uh, KelsF02, uh, it's kind of hard for us to play with you, but you can get our world and make your older brother as payback for giving you such a bad, inconvenient name, perhaps, on Minecraft. You can make him go get that world and let you, uh, play on it. And it sounds like you may have already done that because you've got a farm on top of your house, but I, if you're just playing on a regular world and you want to try our world, ask your brother, make your brother, go get our seed. Um... Now, guys, I'm not going to be able to read every single one of these comments, but I am kind of going through here. Uh, Bob is so cool, man, too, says, I love this show. It is so funny. I like your name. Bob is cool, man, too. There's a lot of cool names. Mm -hmm. Halfblood 2000 j who is a new subscriber, by the way, says, do you have any other videos other than these? Or do you have any videos other than these? And we primarily have episodes... Uh, Q&A videos like this one, and we also have short films. And the short films are really a way for us to experiment with trying something that we haven't done before. If you watch each short film, you'll see that they get more complex as time goes on. Either they're longer, or maybe not even longer, but they have more complicated material. And if you look at the very first one and look at the very last one, you'll see a big difference. Um, not necessarily one being funnier than the other, it's just learning more techniques and also in integrating more elements. In the last video that we did, short film number nine, Full Iron Quiver, we were basically taking a whole minute from a real film and putting it into Minecraft. Fairly 
accurately in terms of timing, in terms of sets, in terms of people. We had a lot of people on that film, way more than we've ever done, all on our land, all in, in the house, all together wreaking havoc. Uh, was that fun, Mary? Yeah. And you weren't in it, but you got to watch everybody causing havoc, right? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I recorded it on my video camera. Yeah, so maybe we'll figure out a way to get that some of that on the internet. It was so funny. It was fun. It took four <laughs> hours to do one minute of film. Yep. And I got to watch the whole thing. You did. It's kind of fun to just sit back every once in a while. Yeah, and my dad was so frustrated. I was furious. He was yelling. And... I was a good director. No. No, that's what directors do. They're like, get over there! Yeah, but... Anyway, um, we have another comment from NoLab143691 who says, a Lovecraft without the build-up? What? And he's talking about Dad sitting around watching Mary build. Dad's bored, and he says, this is like a Lovecraft short story without the build-up. That's kind of an inside joke. If you've ever read, and I doubt a lot of you little kids have, uh, Lovecraft is an author. He writes 19th century, uh, or I should well, actually 19th and early 20th century. Uh, short fiction, weird fiction it used to be called. And you can Google him. I'll, I'll leave it at that. But a lot of his work is uh, build-up. So you'll have a short story where there's a, a lot of build-up, and that's pretty much all that's in the short story with a very, you know, punchline at the end. So the, the point I was trying to make there, uh, no lab 143691, is that a short story without, a Lovecraft short story without any build-up is essentially nothing. So but Dad was basically saying he had nothing to do. He was bored. Now, I know you can't explain jokes like that, but I'm just doing it for your benefit. Uh, for those of you who know Lovecraft, you will get the joke, and you hopefully will think it's funny. And... Is uh, the Lovecraft dude still alive? No, he died like in the movies. Lol, uh, Scopian12 says, you guys are so funny, I'm going to sub. Thanks for the sub. Anyway, he says, I was thinking that since you keep calling your house the mothership, you should make it into a spaceship sometime. Also, just a suggestion to involve your subs a little more, you could do some sort of special guest subscriber once in a while. You know, maybe me. <laughs> I just started watching, so I don't know much, like if it's you two only. Anyway, keep up the good work. Well, it is us two only in the episodes right now, but I'm not going to comment on whether or not that might change, but... Obviously, we are working on things and making changes and updating things and looking at the plot. And we had one other comment I want to go back to, which is EOD Cobra says, I love it. This is the way Minecraft was meant to be played. No massive overwhelming mods and texture packs. Just keep it, keep it simple. He's talking about episode 11, of course, not this. However, it would be pretty neat to see Dad, Mary, and Aether who agrees for an Aether episode. It could be like a dream world where Dad and Mary have to fight through to wake up, and I think that might be great. I think the Aether is single player, though. I'm pretty sure right now, but yeah, that's great. We might do that. And last but not least, we have uh, someone asking... Cold Eye on Don't says, You guys are awesome. I can't wait for a backstory episode of some kind. Is it in the works? And just a quick answer to that, that we will be weaving in backstory in lots of episodes, little by little, until the backstory and the current story, if you want to call it that, uh, match up. So that's the plan. Uh, Mary, do you have anything you want to say? Um, well, thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoy it. And, and I think that's it for now. We're going to try another texture pack. Yeah, we're going to try time. another texture pack in the next Q&A. We'll just keep kind of rotating through these. And right now, my vote still for the first one. I think, Mary, you are weekly voting for this one. Um, That's your favorite, but I, not really. Not really. Not I really. don't really like it because the tools are really confusing. Well, that's that, and we'll see you guys later. All right. Bye. Bye.